everybody. Happy Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, August 11th, 2009. And uh, we are working on a model today of a building. It uses a regular piece of origami paper. So get your supplies together and we'll get started right away. Begin today's model with your paper with the white side facing up and fold it in half vertically and then open it right back up. Then you're going to fold it in half horizontally but only crease from the center out to one side, not the other, and open it back up. So you don't have a crease on this side, you have a crease on this side. And then take the bottom and fold it up to the uh, line that you just created, the crease that you just created. And then finally, fold your piece uh, in half, like so. Now hold the piece with the uh, side that has the crease facing you. And what you want to do then is to fold the tip of this over. You're going to fold down to that line, like so. And then, once you've done that, open this up a bit so that you can push down. Here, I'll show it to you from the side. Push down on this and reverse this bit all the way inside here and then fold it down so you end up with a piece that looks like this again I'm going to show you what I did this is folded over uh, like this and then I take this top piece and I'm pushing down on it and folding it in like that so that this part is folded inside and this part's folded over. And you end up with something that looks like this. Now take the top part of this and you're going to uh, fold this back over top of itself. So what you might want to do first is to create a nice little crease like this first. And the, the crease is going on, on this side here from down to higher on this end. So your crease is going like this. Lower on this end, higher on that end. And then just put your finger in here and reverse, you do it this way, reverse the whole thing over top like that. So now you have like a little a little cap on top of that bit there. All right, so your piece looks like this. You want to flip it around to the other side and fold over and in half like this. And then finally, this little flap here, fold it backwards to create a crease or fold it back and forth, I'd say, to create a crease and then go ahead and push it, reverse it inside. And then you just want to open it up a bit. Pull on it a little bit, open it up. And that's supposed to be to open up that roof line. Uh, I don't know. I'm not quite sure of the point of this because then you flip your piece back around. And this is, this is your building. I don't write them, I just do them. Okay, so that's our building. It does stand up. If you put it down on a flat surface, it will stand up for you. Oh, I just raised my building. Um, <laughs> at any rate, that's it for today. Uh, tomorrow's model, it's called a bead holder. I'm not quite sure on this one. 
It looks like it's just some way to fold a little piece of origami paper so that it has some hidden pockets in it. And I suppose you could put whatever you want in those pockets. It doesn't have to be beads, but that's what they're calling it. So um, we'll work our way through that one tomorrow. In the meantime, enjoy the rest of your Tuesday. I'll see you back here pretty soon.